good morning students in this video we will learn to calculate mean deviation in continuous series so here question is given calculate mean deviation from mean for the given data one side class intervals are given 10 to 20 20 to 30 30 to 50 50 to 70 70 to 80 another side frequency is given 5 8 16 8 3 now first we have to write formula for mean deviation it is summation of frequency absolute deviation over summation of frequency now first we need to calculate mean uh, for continuous series formula for mean is summation of ft upon summation of f now we have to calculate First, we need to know X series, yani midpoint. That means midpoint of class interval. So, 10 to 20 midpoint is midpoint. Kaise calculate karte? Lower limit plus upper limit over 2. 20 plus 10, 30. 30 divided by 2, 15. Similarly, 30 plus 20, 50. 50 divided by 2. 25 50 50 plus 30 80 80 upon 2 40 70 plus 50 divided by 2 60 next 70 plus 80 divided by 2 75 so x is 15 25 40 60 75 next we need to calculate d so D, we need to subtract X. From X, we need to subtract mean. Now, what do we need to calculate? Mean. Okay, now we need to calculate mean. Okay, so mean calculate for mean, you can direct uh, Fx, summation of Fx upon Fp. Okay, so what do we calculate first? We calculate मीन निकालने के लिए सबसे पहले आपको एफ एक्स चाहिए 5 into 15 75 so 75 25 into 8 200 40 into 16 640 60 into 8 480 75 into 3 225 now total of frequency is 40 and total of fx is 1620 calculate mean 1620 over frequency sum of frequency now solve this decimal mein aega aapka 40.5 to mean aapka kitna aagya 40.5 now calculate d X series से mean को subtract करते जाओगे तो आपका क्या आ जाएगा D ठीक है uh, 15 minus 40.5 will be minus 25.5 25 minus 40.5 will be minus 15.5 40 minus uh, 40.5 will be zero minus 0 0.5 60 minus 40.5 will be 19.5 and 75 minus 40.5 will be 34. Now we have to calculate absolute D. Absolute D will be 25.5. Absolute D kya hota hai? Jo apne D nikala hai. Isme negative or positive both values hoti hai. Aur absolute D isme hum negative values ko consider nahi karte. Sare numbers hi positive ho jate hai. So, this is 25.5, then 15.5, 0 0.5, 19.5, and 34. Uh, 34, sorry, 34.5. This is 34.5. Okay. Now, we have to calculate the formula. Next, we have to do the formula. Next, we have to according to absolute deviation. We have to multiply the frequency. So, last. We will multiply frequency with absolute 
डेविएशन डी ठीक है तो ये ये एब्सोल्यूट डेविएशन है इसको मल्टीप्लाई करेंगे फ्रीक्वेंसी के साथ एंड वी विल गेट सी फर्स्ट फ्रीक्वेंसी इज फाइव एब्सोल्यूट डेविएशन इज ट्वेंटी फाइव पॉइंट फाइव सो मल्टीप्लाई ट्वेंटी फाइव पॉइंट फाइव विथ फाइव एंड यू विल गेट वन ट्वेंटी सेवन पॉइंट फाइव नेक्स्ट फिफ्टीन पॉइंट फाइव मल्टीप्लाई विथ एट एंड यू विल गेट वन ट्वेंटी फोर पॉइंट फाइव मल्टीप्लाई एट विथ सिक्सटीन एंड यू विल गेट एट नाइनटीन पॉइंट फाइव मल्टीप्लाई एट विथ एट एंड यू विल गेट वन फिफ्टी सिक्स नेक्स्ट लास्ट थर्टी फोर पॉइंट फाइव मल्टीप्लाई दिस नंबर विथ थ्री एंड यू विल गेट वन हंड्रेड एंड थ्री पॉइंट फाइव नाउ we have to add all the numbers and you will get 519 so this is the submission of frequency with absolute deviation 590 now divide it with submission of frequency that was 40 now divide this and you will get 12.975 this is your mean deviation in continuous series that's all thank you